Welcome to another episode of The Walking Dead. I was going to do Bully, but I did not save, so I got to go do it all over again. But y'all sit back and relax and take this hour long episode. And I don't have my face thing because I don't have. I have a new computer, so I don't have my webcam set up. I'm gonna have it set up later. Sit back and enjoy it for the ride. Oh, oh let's get this memory phone to use that for my back. Good luck smothering them to death. That's not really what I have in mind. your gun. But the noise. Just follow my lead. Stay right behind me. Yo, girl, you got some change, dog. No, no, we are. That was sick. No, I ain't even messing with a cut. Let me just go. I wonder if there's anything in the pickup. Wait. Let me see the spark plug. Porcelain inside these things turns car windows to tissue paper. That's a handy idea. Man, what they doing? Nah, nah, I'm just going back to the <sighs> That could scramble a brain pretty good. That's exactly what I was thinking. Come on, Lee, you can move faster than that. Oh, these chitlins taste good. We still have some mustard. Yo, show it in. Come over here, man. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. Who calling my name? My name is Frank.
Dude, where'd your weapon go? Into that ice big sized hole. <laughs> Holy shit. It's cool. Now we've got this. Are you two done? Two more. That should help. We're about to cut some heads off. Don't mind my breathing. Why don't you guys lag behind just in case this goes to hell? Okay, we'll be right behind you. Yo, yo, he coming up the stairs, girl. Hurry up and get that, that baby. He coming up the stairs, girl. He right there. Man, what you want? What you want, man? Yo, you kill my wife, Samantha. Oh, rad. Hello in there. We're here to help. Please just go away. Let's go, guys. In a minute. If you open up, we can take you somewhere safer. We've got a group in town. No, no, no. Please. She's in trouble. No. Miss, we're coming in. She's over the door. Stop, just stop. I'm coming out. You gay? Oh, God. I... I said stay away. We need to get you help. It's too late for that. Guys, she's been bitten. What? I told you, I said go away! I'm bit! But you wouldn't just leave. Let's calm down. You could be fine. I won't be fine. My boyfriend was bitten. You get sick and you die and, and you come back and you kill anything you can find. You have a boyfriend? You have a boyfriend. Yeah. I don't want that. It's they not know Christian. What I was talking about. Please, just leave me. Please go. Okay, we'll leave. Just try to take care of yourself for whatever time you have left. You have a gun. So? Can I borrow it? What do you mean, borrow? Give it to me? I can just... You know, end this, and then, then there's no problem. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Please, I don't want to be one of them. They're, they're You look like a satanic. coke addict. You need to be one of them. Give it to her. What? You can't be serious. Do it. No! Look at her, Carly. There's no happy ending to this. Okay. Fine. Thank you so much. I know how terrible this must be. We can't watch this. Let's go. We can't go yet. What? Why not? Because somebody needs to pick up the gun. We can't leave it. You two go on. Okay. Y'all shut up out there. You sure? I don't want to hear that. Yeah. God bless you, all right? God bless you too. some coke addicts they wanted that money that money real bad everyone all right yeah we had some close calls but glenn is fine and well yeah we're okay 
I've got a few cans of gas for your pickup in the trunk of my car. Good to hear it. And things back here? Quiet. Our friend is still in and out over there. He won't survive any more stress. The next order of business is getting those pills out of the pharmacy. Time. How's your finger, Cleo? Good. It doesn't hurt so much anymore. Good. Let me know if you need anything. Okay. I'm not ready to ask that question. I probably could be her dad. You don't know if her mom was a skank. Want to go have a look around outside? Let's have a look around. Okay. <sighs> Let's go see what's out there. Eat. As far as I can tell, he's all they care about. And if one gets you, they eat you. And whatever's left comes back as one of them. How the fuck? I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. Yeah, I think so too. We better keep it down out of here. That guy over there has the keys. How can you be sure? I found this in the office. That boy in the photo worked here. The keys being on him is as good a bet as we can make. Yeah, I agree. Man, at least I want that's your brother. Out how to get out there and get them. You wouldn't need long, right? Nah, just a few seconds. Maybe there's a way to distract them and buy you some time. I can't reach that brick. You can do anything with this? You know what I could do? What's that? It's universal. I could program it to work with those TVs across the street. I just hope the power's still on. You can just do that? Well, I memorized all the codes when I was in AV. Let's try. Fucking done, Doug. All that dork nonsense might save a life. Who's to say it already hasn't? Man, I love the white channel. Notice. The white channel, I love it, but not enough. Nah, it's not the introduction. I mean, interesting. I can't reach that brick. Mahomes, let's go. It is touchdown. The white channel. It's the white channel. Y'all look at the white channel. Yeah. I love the white channel. Yeah, yeah. I love the white channel. Now's the time. Be careful. Keep an eye out, will you? Lee. Lee, I love you, Lee. I want you. You 
look delicious, hey, boy. Good, good. Yeah. Good boy. I don't know what happened to mom and dad, but I know if you were there, you would have died for them. So I want your buddy, guy. Give me every so day we for guilt at the loot. Did you find you? them yet? Yeah. Give me a second. Let it get. You probably taste like some chicken. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I wasn't here. Give me your blood, boy. But knowing you were to oh, take care of the leg, the head. That helps. The guts is the pressure part. It's my cheese. Put your ranch. It's a good thing. I love you, man. I love you, man. There we go. Holy crap! Yo, black on black crime, Run! man. Black on black crime. Get that nigga. He killed that nigga. He killed my man. He killed that nigga. Go get you, you fat boy. Guts and everything. <laughs> man, that was close. But we did it. It's all that matters. That was so funny. I've got the keys. Great. God, you're amazing. Let's get in there. You want to give me top? <laughs> okay, let's get ahead, boy. Open this key. Open this door. Gotta hurry. So woo. Girl, you looking fine. Girl, you look fine. You wanna come by me? Hell no. Okay, take it away from me then. Big nose so that's why you got a shoulder. That's why you got a screwdriver in your shoulder. Black on black crime. All lives matter. All lives matter. All lives matter. All lives matter. Come on, baby, time to go. I'm gonna get the truck pulled up right back. Do it fast. I gotta get my dad out of here. I don't plan on dilly dallying. Honey, take Duck into the office and barricade the living hell out of the door behind me. Glenn, when you hear me honking in the alley, start getting people out of here. You got it. Doug, Carly, and Lee, you guys make sure our defenses stay up till then. And Lee, I better take that axe in case I run into any of them on the way to my truck. Here you go. Mike, that door's not locked anymore. Shit. You three, get on it. I'll get back as fast as I can. Stay away from the windows. Make it through this. You should know that I think you're a great guy. Thanks, Doug. Doug, if we don't make it through this, you should know. I should know what? Huh? You said I should know. Are you sure? Okay, then. Give it time. Can you look for something to stick in between the handles? Something real strong, okay? Okay. Clementine, did you find anything? Nothing. Wait. The window is screwed. Go. Get up! Ah! 
fat, let me eat you. Oh, all lives matter. Why you kill me, Lee? I want to eat your guts. Hey, Glenn. I think I need to go. To Atlanta? Yeah. I got friends there. And I just can't stay here knowing that they could be trapped in that city. Sounds like nobody knows what's happening there. When we left a few days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. Find your friends. Be safe. Thanks, Lee. That means a lot. I don't mean to abandon you all, but this seems like an okay setup. And I'm sure things will be back to normal around here in no time. Let's hope. You guys be safe. We'll try. And Lee, you know, if this doesn't get better, people are going to give up. Like the girl from upstairs. Are you just going to let them? You told Carly to give her the gun. Yeah, I did. Maybe you were right. I don't know how to handle something like that. Anyway, see you around. Let's see you around, not see ya. Ya is not a word. It's an acronym. Not an acronym, it's an acronym. <laughs> Shit happens. <laughs> Hey, Ken. Close call back there. Thanks for picking me up. No problem. We have to take care of each other. Yeah, we do. Hey, about Clementine. Yeah? Earlier I said there's some stuff out there that might screw up a precious little girl like her. You did. Well, I still think that's true. But after what I saw today, I think between you taking care of her and her taking care of herself, you two are going to be just fine. Thanks, Kitty. You got it. How you doing, Carly? I'm okay. 
you know, considering. I do, yeah. I can't stop thinking about Doug. We couldn't have saved him, could we? I don't think so. It happened pretty fast. I know it's stupid. We just met. And he was such a... It's just that I think that I liked him. Well, I'm sure he liked you, too. <laughs> you better have. Anyway, I'd rather be alone, I think. I understand. Wait, Lee? What is it? How did you choose? We both needed you. You picked me. I was going to help you both. But you helped me first. Yeah, I did. I just wish we both could have made it, you know? Me too, Carly. Crip, if you don't get over that boy. Just like, um, what's he say? Wait, um, what's see ever say? If that boy don't love you by now. He won't never, ever, never, ever love you. That's all like pow, pow, pow. I thought Super Dinosaur was toast. You. Oh. you know what? He wasn't. Oh, and then? Hey, Duck, uh, you want to cool it for a minute? Okay, sorry. I'm sorry there's uh, not a lot of kids here. No, it's not that. It's... I got grabbed again. I was there, though. I fell, and my walkie-talkie broke. Glenn had the other one. Oh, I'm sorry. Thanks. I know I need to be tough. I'm just sad. I know it doesn't make any sense, but it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. And now they're gone. It's gone. Maybe we can find you another one. I'll just keep this one, I guess. Lee, come here for a second. Hmm. Let me go deal with this. Oh, man, Clementine, another thing. What do you want? You like my daughter? Yeah, she's great. Well, stay the fuck away from her. Or what? Or, uh, everyone will know that you, Lee Everett, are a killer. And you were before it was something you had to do to stay alive. I know who you are. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, <laughs> you watch your ass. Hey, Lee, do you have a second? My dad would be dead if it weren't for you. That guy Doug is dead because of me. You can't be like that. You're only one man. I don't know. We're lucky to have you. I hope that's the sound of us winning this thing. Me too. This motor end's pretty damn defendable. We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We could stay here until the military rolls through. I actually agree with that plan. Me too. We got beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. There are worse places to call home. Yeah, you're right. You know, guys, I think it's going to be okay. <laughs> yeah, that's the end of episode one, but this is the end of episode two. I thought we'd be fine if we survived the walkers. Never expected they'd starve us out. I want you to have this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. You don't owe me anything, Carly. How you doing, Clementine? I'm really hungry, Lee. We gotta get food, Lee. Soon. Howdy, I'm Andrew St. John. We're from the St. John Dairy. It's beautiful. I never did thank you for saving Duck from the Walkers back at Herschel's farm. Something's coming, Lee. There's gonna be a war. The Walkers don't worry me as much as the bandits. You fuck with us! Now we're gonna take what we want! There's too many of them! This 
sounded so so awkward. Let's go wrap up this episode. It says you and fifty four percent of players were honest. You and thirty percent for players who stuck. You and fifty four for players defended Kenny. You and forty seven players gave her the gun, and you and forty eight percent of players she was calling. So we're gonna continue this later. Thank you.